So yesterday I was on the internet, you know, as you do. I took a wrong turn, right? Ended up on Reddit. And through Reddit, I found this news article posted just yesterday. Two men plan to have large python eat woman's daughter before blowing up her house. And uh, here we have a photo of the crime scene, which looks like Breaking Bad happened here. Now, there is no news of anyone actually being injured in this news article. I want to open that up by just saying the charges that were laid were more so conspiracy charges. It doesn't seem like someone was injured. It says, two Georgia men are accused of setting off a bomb at a woman's home and plotting to release a python to eat her daughter. And these are the two men in question. You could just expect them to commit some Looney Tunes level crime. They got the bomb. They got the python. They're like one step away from trying to uh, drop a grand piano on someone. Now, the reason for them doing this, right? So this dude and the woman apparently met on a dating app, but it says their relationship went south, so they decided to block each other. And then, after blocking each other, this dude got involved. And then it says, the men allegedly planned to shoot arrows into the victim's front door, mail her dog feces or dead rats, a uh, scalper, blow up the home, and release a large python to eat her daughter. All because of a breakup. Like, you have a couple of options here. Do you A, crawl into your little cave of mental decline, lay underneath the blankets, blast really sad music for a couple of weeks? Do you B, move on and try to work on yourself? Or do you C, decide to get your friend involved and try to give this woman and her daughter some Mortal Kombat fatality? Like, this whole situation looks like they chose the wrong option in a mobile game. You know those really cheap ones where you have like, it's like a story-based game and you have two options? One of them you have to watch an ad to get and it's like the only reasonable thing. And then the other option is free, but it's something absolutely atrocious. It's like these dudes could not afford the premium option and they were stuck with the most deranged possible choice. So it says they found a black SUV leaving the scene. Then the police served a search warrant on the two guys' homes and their phones. They were then indicted on a slew of charges, including unlawful possession of an explosive, first degree arson, stalking, use of explosive to commit another felony offense, conspiracy to use an explosive to commit a felony, and possession of an unregistered destructive device. It looks like they have potential to be in prison for a very long time. Now, I know I'm all over the place with what I post on this channel, and I've never really posted myself going over a news article, let alone one that's so short, but you can't just show me this conspiracy for these two dudes to make a python eat someone's daughter and blow up her house and then not expect me to say something. Like, I'm gonna talk about it. I can't just sit in silence, you know? I'm gonna explode. I'm gonna become the bomb, right? Right? I'm gonna detonate if I have to keep this inside because I think people are just getting a little too too creative to one think of this But then also it's weird that they would think that this would actually work I mean obviously the bomb would work It's a bomb, but you can't just sick a python on someone and expect that to work You can't just hungry hungry hippo that shit. They aren't just this never-ending well of hunger So this plan was not this was not gonna work out But yeah, I just wanted to talk about this because uh, I don't know how you just see this and and don't talk about it Right like I'm gonna yap. I be yapping. I will continue to yap. So yeah, have a great rest of your day.